Hello friends, it's Jeff here from Squadron. Now you might think, why is there a rabbit draped over his head? Well, I got a perfectly good explanation for that. Other than looking completely stupid and utterly ridiculous, there is a reason why I'm wearing the Yushanka. Not too long ago, I watched uh, the documentary about the battle for Stalingrad and I got inspired by it. That's why I wanted to get into the zone. Now, Russian subjects were never my forte, never had much interest in it, and I wanted to change that. I also like winter dioramas, and since it's been a while since I created one, it was the perfect opportunity for my next project. So instead of pulling another T-34 off the shelf and start building, I wanted to put a little bit more thought behind the whole idea. Uh, so I did some research, and I know that a lot of you guys are familiar with the Land Lease Program that was going on as early as 1941 between the United States government and Russia, where the United States government sent boatloads of military equipment to aid uh, the Russians. Uh, TACOM, a while ago, released three model kits that were based on the M3 chassis, two lease and uh, a grand. One of the Lee versions had Russian markings, and that's exactly the kit I picked uh, for my project. So I got all three ingredients in place. I got the war on the Russian front, I got the winter dioramas, and I got an American tank to put, to put smack dab in the middle of my project. So let me get uh, to the warehouse, let's pick one off the shelf, and let's start building.
Found it. This was absolutely a fun build. Uh, I enjoyed every minute of it from start to finish. Takon went the extra mile to create this little gem and the detail is absolutely superb. Uh, there is hardly any issues with fit. Um, this is the way to go. If you are a fan of the M3 family or the Sherman family, this is a, a kit to have in your collection. Now, if I might add a little bit of critique is about the bogey assemblies. Those things are a little pain. Uh, they have a lot of parts and maybe a little bit too over-engineered and complex, but that's just nitpicking. But meanwhile, I put it on our moments in time base on the cobblestone section and actually it looks quite a part. So, but for now, I'm gonna leave it at that. Uh, again, this is an extremely beautiful model. And if you don't have one by now, you can pick one up, go to our website, that's squadron.com. But for now, I think that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. Nancy here, signing off. Hey Jeff, can you come over here for a second? Jeff? Who's Jeff? <laughs>